greetings and it's our joy to be able to come to you and spend this day with you in in prayer and in a few moments in the word this week we've been talking about the fact of god becoming a man and looking at every stage every phase every step in that journey and today i want to remind us that the reason he came into this world to be as he became a man and died dying for our sins that led to the glorious resurrection which is so widely important for our salvation first peter chapter 3 verses 18 and verse 22 the apostle peter wrote for christ also suffered once for sins the just for the unjust that he might bring us to god being put to death in the flesh but made alive by the spirit verse 22 who has gone into heaven and is at the right hand of god angels and authorities and powers having me made subject to him so peter points out this whole sequence that he suffered for our sins so that he might bring us to god and then he has gone into the heavens he ascended he was made alive by the spirit resurrected by the spirit and he ascended into heaven so this god who became a man lived as a man died as a man but then it didn't it didn't end there there was this glorious being made alive by the spirit resurrected by the power of the holy spirit and he ascended into heaven and is at the right hand of the father the eternal word having taken on that that glory which he had left behind and he seated there co-equal with the father and with the spirit part of the godhead having completed the work for us now paul the apostle points out that if the resurrection had not taken place if he had not been made alive by the spirit and if he had not ascended to the father then everything would have been in vain we would not be we would not have been saved so this great glorious resurrection is so important for our salvation that as he was raised by the spirit and ascended into heaven he not only paid for our sins but he said death cannot hold me down that which adam plunged us under sin satan and that could not keep christ in subjection could not hold him down he conquered death that very thing that overpowered every human person jesus christ conquered death showing us that death will no longer have dominion over us a glorious day is coming for all of us when we ourselves will be raised up by the power of the holy spirit and will ascend into the very presence of god and then it shall be said oh death where is your sting oh grave where is your victory and we can shout out shout that out even now because we know christ has already conquered death he has already conquered the grave and he has ascended into the very presence of the father from whence he came and because of that we have this blessed hope of a glorious resurrection because he lives we will live also let's worship jesus for that lord we thank you that you became a man you lived and died but you rose up conquering that final enemy death conquering that final enemy the grave and you have the keys of hell and the grave in your hands we worship you jesus amen thank you for tuning in to living supernaturally for more resources to strengthen your spiritual walk please visit apcwo.org